it's me Kia, your favorite and i'm back with another video so as you can see i am living in the lap of luxury as you knew i always would um but yeah so i just got to atlanta i'm in town visiting my friend for her baby shower she's having a little girl so i'm really excited i'm gonna catch up with another one of my home girls but you know they built this they built this hotel probably like a year ago a year and some change before i left and i never stayed here um i've never actually even been to the restaurant so i'll probably eat here before i go but me and my other friend we're gonna go to Rumi's kitchen um because i'm feeling like a mediterranean vibe and she was feeling the same vibe but if y'all know me y'all know i don't really like hotels and so it's just like traveling that's like my least favorite part is staying in a hotel so i was like okay let me just stay in like a nice one and see what it's about and like honestly when i first came here i was kind of like oh is that it but actually i really like it in here like i see what they did like it's very like simple yet you know elevated it kind of feels like a little apartment with the floors and the style and everything so i changed my mind and i actually do like it and i do have like a cute view kind of as well of like the phipps plaza courtyard um that's cute like the little nespresso and cups are just cute i love this table like this just simple touches of just like elegance and elevation so okay i see what you did there a no boo but yeah the baby shower is in athens so i have to ride there so i'm probably about to get in the shower and then order some room service but i also um got like a book for the baby um and i got them a baby carrier but i just sent that to their house um so i want to get like maybe just some sephora gift card or some goodies or something to put it in like the bag for the baby and everything get something for my friend because i always like to get something for my friends specifically when it's like a baby shower because don't forget the moms y'all like when i become a mom don't forget me like buy me gifts bring me items so i always like to do that for my friends too because we're gonna get stuff for the baby but like you know treat your girls so i need to figure out if i'm going to go to like sephora or something the sephora that's over here before i head out um but yeah that's the vibes so yeah i'm just sitting chilling taking it all in it's like crazy to be back in atlanta as like a visitor and not as a liver um for those of y'all that don't know i just moved from atlanta six months ago and i lived here for like almost six years it was like five and a half years that i lived here so it's just nice to be back and just vibing and enjoying the city and it's just like reminds me of that it was such an era and now i'm just like you know back on different terms and i just i love that i love that for me but it's a fun little place so we're gonna vibe it out yeah <laughs>
pretty tasty yeah yeah this avocado toast has like some arugula radishes carrots and pickled onions so it's good mm. Mm -hmm. mm. i'm enjoying the vibes i took a shower and i steamed my dress because they have a steamer which came in clutch because my dress is kind of silky i was thinking like am i gonna be overdressed but i don't feel like i am i just found like a cute pink dress to wear because it said it was a tea party so i'm like okay but it's also like winter so i want to wear something long at the same time so it's like long sleeves and like long pink so it kind of gives like a gown but at the same time i feel like it's you know nice but like not doing too much but you definitely could dress that up like i was thinking like i can wear that to some weddings um this spring and summer so like it's really really cute got it from asos i'm gonna do um an asos haul i just was keeping it like light and cute with the fruit the eggs the toast like yesterday i was a vegetarian i was kind of a vegetarian this week because like sometimes i just don't be eating meat so i don't know it was just like that kind of week for me and then i did like start my cycle so maybe like that's why but i feel okay you know i feel good so hopefully you know it doesn't ramp up and if it does it could just save it until tomorrow because today is not the day but i need to figure out what i'm gonna do with my hair i think i might do a braid but i don't know yet um or i might just like straighten my edges a little bit and then like keep it pulled back or like pull this up maybe do a little ponytail curls i don't know i have to figure that out i decided to just set my makeup up right here because i just want to sit down and just like do it in the natural light plus i'm just like still trying to relax and conserve some of my energy so i would do it in the bathroom but this is cute overlooking the little view and then makeup so i'm just doing something simple apparently because i left my foundation and i could have swore i grabbed it like i thought i brought my dior foundation so that's weird like i don't know where it is but it's cool because i don't need it i'll still do some cute but yeah that's what's tea what's going on y'all what did i bring um serious question because apparently i don't have setting powder excuse me um so what did i bring I don't know so maybe you guys know because how do I not have setting powder but I have been using this Patrick Star one size setting mist and it's supposed to be like very mattifying and stuff so I feel like this could actually work because my goal was to use like my Dior skin glow which is kind of dewy set it and then like I didn't know this was mattifying when I got it so actually maybe not setting this and then using this will give the desired effect but like why didn't i bring setting powder that's crazy it's something else i forgot too so i'm just really sitting here looking like wow like how did i pack the the makeup but it's looking okay so i'm just gonna go ahead and finish this up and then go across the street to sephora because it's across the street at lennox so the makeup is where it's at and i've moved on to the hair so right now i kind of just like ran the flat iron through my entire hair and what's cool is they have nobu flat iron that's cool um i didn't use this because i have my own but if you did need this they have it this looks nice too this is a nice flat iron um i think this is so you can like set your flat iron on i should have been using this but i don't know if that's really what it's for who knows but this is how my hair is looking and like i'm so tempted to like wear my hair down because it could be cute or a moment but i don't trust it like not to poof up and me look, be looking crazy but this is how it be like i'll be gassing myself up inside of the house because i'll be like oh my hair is cute but then go outside poof so i'm thinking if i hurry up and go to sephora wear my hair down and then come back and see how it looks and then i can decide if i can keep it like this or i will just put it back 
into a braid. So I need to hurry up and leave and come back so I can do my little experiment. Change of plans. Honestly, I really don't have the capacity and I don't wanna be like rushing. So I'm gonna just pull my hair back and I'm gonna do like half up, half down. So even if it gets poofy, it's gonna be like in a ponytail partially and it'll also be to the back and All right, y'all, so this is the look. I'm not trying to rush, but I'm kind of rushing. This dress is from ASOS, it's cute. I feel like it's very baby girl, baby shower. I was gonna wear this with open toe shoes, but it's literally freezing in Atlanta, and I feel like the boots still look cute with it. Originally, I was gonna have this like more open, open toes. Not like open, but like, you know, I did tie it in the back because it has like this little string that goes across, but just to kind of close it a little bit. For my fragrance, I have, what is this? Gucci Guilty Intense and Jo Malone Mimosa Cardamom. So that's what we're wearing. Let me just spread a little more so I smell good. Um, yeah, so I need to get a gift bag, a gift from Sephora. This is the little book that I got for baby girls, like a little unicorn book. And I'm gonna get something for the mom. Actually, I'm gonna just put it all in the Sephora bag. See, yes, hopefully they have tissue paper so I can just go to Sephora, get the gift card, put this in that bag. See, I thought I was gonna have to go to Walgreens and everything else, but anyways, y'all, hope y'all like the look and I'm going to just put it with my fur coat. Bam, bam, and I'm off. The shower was fun and cute. It was no, so nice to see my friend. And then I came back and I saw my other friend. And we went to Rumi's Kitchen, which was good. I literally just ate that for breakfast. Um, and I got the lamb. And she got some chicken. And we got some hummus. And we ate carbs. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that was cute then i'm like oh i'm staying over here and she's like because she's like do you want to go somewhere else and then we we're like oh we can just go to nobu because like neither of well i don't know if she's ever eaten at no she has eaten at nobu i never ate at nobu but um so i was like i'm staying here so obviously i want to eat something but we had already ate but you know the girls are always eating the yellowtail from nobu so um she never tried yellowtail before so i wanted to try it from nobu she went to try it for the first time so we ate that and it was cool and the waiter he kept looking in my eyes so i looked him back in his eyes like do you want to be my man but obviously i wasn't trying to you know let him be my man but it was fun because in the end i was just like oh can you put this on our on my tab for my room he was like you don't have a tab i was like oh no like i'm staying at the hotel so you can just like charge it to the room he was like you don't have a tab and we was like oh okay so that was fun because we didn't have to pay <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to get in the shower and then pack up because I think checkout is at 11, but they said I could technically leave at noon. But I'm trying to see if there's anywhere I want to go, like anything I want to get before I go to the airport, like anything that I'm missing here in the A, like some place for like breakfast or brunch because my flight is not until four, I think. Is that four or something? So I can head to the airport around 2.33. 
so i'll have a couple of hours after checkout so i might see what's around here something that i want to do but yeah it's been cute it's been a fun trip and i enjoyed myself i usually don't like trips like i just like vacations like short trips are you gotta come in and you gotta leave and then it's just like it's too much like traveling like i just got here so i usually don't like trips but this was cute and it was fun and i'm glad i stayed here because it actually made it like more comfortable and, and relaxing because a lot of times when i you know travel and take trips if i'm not like staying with somebody if i have to stay in a hotel i just be like uncomfortable can't really sleep but yeah i got some good sleep here so that was cool but i'm definitely excited to get home and get back in my bed and as y'all saw i like washed all my sheets and everything with my really good smelling buff city detergent so i just already know it's about to be a love affair when i get home and i'm just so excited about that like y'all i love my bed like i really love my bed my house my bedding just like being all cozy in there so i'm very excited to get back home and everything too Oh, is that a gym up there? Y'all, I'm looking. I just see this man moving in the window. I'm like, what is he up there doing? He's on the elliptical. But um, <clears throat> anyways, that was weird.